Hello, I'm Jenny Sabares and welcome to this step-by-step -step tutorial for the ASEAN Customs Declaration Document or ACDD. It is the key enabling e-document used for smooth inter-ASEAN trade. Each ASEAN country uses its National Single Window or NSW that in turn transacts through the larger ASEAN Single Window or ASW. Of course, there are some key requirements in registering and signing up for the ACDD. To help explain this further, let's call on our guest expert, Mr. Alvin Ohena. Thanks, Jenny. To recall, the ACDD is the Unified Electronic Document that facilitates safe and secure trade across borders of every ASEAN member state. It is used by the ASW in its function as a clearinghouse of all validated trade documentation. It does this by efficiently integrating all export, import, transit, and other crucial data into one verified e-document. The usual requirements for all trading stakeholders must be accomplished and are found on the Bureau of Customs website. These ensure that as an accredited exporter, your tax identification number is duly registered with the BOC and therefore will be recognized by the system. Simply sign in with your TIN to validate your CPRS account. Once verified, you may now create your username. This allows the ACDD portal to extract the 15 key mandatory data elements from your customs export declaration document. Specifically, this would be 1. The Customs Office of Lodgement 2. The type of document 3. Exporter or consigner number, the name and number only. Four, the customs reference number. Five, the importer or consignee number, the name and address only. Number six, the date of exportation. Number seven, the identification of the declarant or representative. The number is mandatory and it's the name and number only. Number eight, the code of the country of exportation. Number nine, the mode of transport. Number 10, the place of loading and unloading. Number 11, the customs office of entry or exit. Number 12, the item number. Number 13, the commodity code or the AHTN. Number 14, the country of origin. And lastly, number 15, the supplementary quantity. This will be viewable by the receiving ASEAN member state or AMS. So by clicking I agree, you are granting your legal consent for the processing of your data. Once your requirements have been met, make sure you've properly filled out the online form. Next, click Submit Registration button. Soon after, you will receive an email notification granting access to the ACDD portal dashboard using a temporary password. You must change this to your preferred password to complete the activation of your ACDD account. Each time you sign in, just use your chosen username and password as you would in an online account. Once you log in, you will be able to view all pertinent information for your exporter account. On your dashboard, you can now view, track status, print, and generate reports. The ACDD portal receives extracted ACDD mandatory data fields from the BOC E2M system. This data is now viewable. The ACDD portal facilitates the sending of the ACDD message to AMS, which can be tracked and acknowledged by the AMS. The ACDD portal receives the ACDD messages from the exporting AMS that can be tracked and acknowledged as received by the importing AMS. At this point, the BOC Risk Management Office can view, print, track the status, and generate reports for all inbound ACDD messages. This is essential to support its risk targeting and profiling activities. Using the ACDD within the Philippine NSW and ASW network will generate some obvious benefits. For one, you will surely enjoy reduced customs clearance times. It will also centralize and streamline your documentation processes. Some ASEAN businesses have already claimed cost savings of as much as 50% due to the efficiency of shared data points across all ASEAN member states. It also has benefits for the larger public. 
the ACDD demonstrates a new era of joint transparency, accountability, and integrity between businesses and key government agencies such as the BOC. And once again, back to you, Jenny. Thank you, and I agree, Alvin. It all just spells better trading and business efficiency for everybody. And that concludes this ACDD tutorial. For more information and updates, please check out and follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, and Instagram. This has been your host, Jenny. Catch us next time for more updates. Thanks again, and let's get on board the ACDD and stay committed to its worthy ideals.